brand new for you at this noon hour. This week, the city will say its final goodbye to a true public servant. City Council President and former Mayor Tommy Missouri Sr. has died at the age of 76. Now, he was placed into hospice care back in August. Doctors said he'd been facing complications from a lung transplant operation last year. Now, a visitation for Missouri will be this Wednesday at Hardage Giddens Oak Lawn Chapel. That's on San Jose Boulevard. His funeral will be Thursday at Mandarin Presbyterian. Missouri will be buried at Oak Lawn Cemetery. And on your side, Leah Shields. She has a closer look at his life and legacy. From easing your commute to work to fighting for equality inside City Hall and even what goes on below ground with the sewage system. Tommy Azuri had a hand in it all. The 76 year old was a Jacksonville native and a passionate leader many can't and won't forget. He said things like this. The motto Jacksonville where Florida begins, it should also read where inequality ends. And he meant it. Tommy Azuri I think will always be remembered as an honest, hardworking public servant. He was a man committed to serving the people of Jacksonville the people who elected him. Just gathered around Tommy. He was a magnet for people. He loved people. Uh, he cared uh, a lot about this city. His impact extends into your daily commute. Many believe his major accomplishment was getting rid of the tolls on the bridges in Jacksonville. He also focused on expanding the city's human rights ordinance to include protections for the LGBTQ community, and he helped Mayor Curry address the pension crisis. He is survived by his wife and kids. In downtown Jacksonville, Leah Shields, First Coast News, on your side. And for continuing coverage, including reaction from more local leaders, you can head over to our webpage, that's firstcoastnews.com.